Business owners across Charlotte are closing their doors this month to give employees much needed time off. Queen City News Chief Business Correspondent Taylor Young joins us now live from North Charlotte. And Taylor, the majority of these businesses that are shutting their doors are restaurants. Yeah, Brian, ask anyone in the restaurant industry and they'll tell you that these last two years have been a struggle. Now, some owners are recognizing that and they're giving their staff weeks off to get away. Inside South 21 Family Restaurant on Brookshire Boulevard, lunch is more than a burger and fries. It's like a family here. Marvin Pewitt may change up his order each visit, but he always gets what he calls the best lunch in town. Uh, this is my favorite place to eat lunch. They have the best food for the best price of just about any place I eat. Starting Monday, he's going to have to go somewhere else. The workers that have greeted him weekly for years are getting a vacation. The last two years we've been doing just a week. So this year I said, you know, we're, we're going to do a full two weeks. Owner Johnny Catapotis says between the pandemic, long hours and food shortages, he and his staff need a break. Just get away and just don't even think about this place and, and what we go through each day because it's a tough business. I don't think people realize how difficult this thing is. And they're not the only ones getting it. Signs on doors across the Queen City read the same message, closed for vacation. It's been tough for a lot of people. Catherine Sally has worked at South 21 for 14 years. I look forward to coming to work every day. It's really fun. We have the best customers and the best boss. Next week, she's using her two-week vacation to hop on a plane for the very first time. Yes, I'm taking my daughter to Vegas in the Grand Canyon. While customers are bummed their favorite lunch spot will be closed, they say the vacation time is well-deserved. I don't know. I might have to bring lunch from home. That means getting up a little extra early and not having a place to get in the air conditioning for a bit, but uh, I'll, I'll get by somehow. And their two weeks vacation starts Monday the 11th. And yes, the owner says it is fully paid. For now, reporting live in North Charlotte, Taylor Young, Queen City News.